As we reported last night here on World News, the survival rate in a U.S. plane crash is actually quite high. 95% of passengers survive plane crashes, according to the NTSB. And in fact, in this case, this crash landing in San Francisco, that percentage even higher. So tonight, ABC's David Wright on the exit strategy to make your flight as safe as possible. This 727 is about to crash on purpose. Seconds before impact, jumpers away, jumpers away. The pilots abandon ship, leaving crash test dummies, cameras, and computers to record what happens next. It's a science experiment conducted by the Discovery Channel to measure the survivability of a plane crash. One conclusion, bracing for impact, like they show on the safety card, actually works. I suspect this one may have a concussion and that one may have a broken leg. Minimizing the chance you'll get knocked out or worse. Another conclusion, passengers at the rear of the aircraft are generally safer, especially in a nosedive crash like this one. The crash here at SFO was slightly unusual in that the plane appeared to belly flop tail first. The two passengers who died were seated near the back. Statistics show that the chance of dying on a scheduled flight here in the U.S. is 1 in 14 million. Riding on a commercial airplane has got about the same amount of risk as riding on an escalator. The danger, not just from the impact itself, smoke and fire start fast, as we saw here in San Francisco, within 90 seconds. This simulator used to train flight crews shows how finding an exit can be tricky, but it's essential to get out fast. If you can't instantly determine the source and severity of the smoke, then you must consider it to be a threat to the airplane. According to the National Transportation Safety Board, 76% of passengers survive even the most serious crashes. The FAA's advice, sit within five rows of an exit, make a mental note of the exits, sit on the aisle, and don't sleep during takeoff and landing. Today I asked the MIT safety expert if there's a particular seat that he requests. He told me, pick an aisle seat close to the exit if possible.